Radio, Raheem, with Luke Action Jackson. I got to tell you, coming up, Action Jackson was a totally different guy. Hey, where did you get this nickname? Well, I got it from, uh, I think, school. Action Jackson, my last name is Jackson, so they used to call me Action. So, <laughs> it's, uh, yeah. Well, First and foremost, I watch a lot of your interviews, man. It's, it's a surreal um, moment for me to be finally interviewed by you because I've watched your uh, your. your you, your content for many years. So. Oh, wow. I appreciate that, man. Well, it's an honor to interview you, yeah, you as well, yeah, man. I, you. I appreciate thank, you thank, saying thank, that. Thank you, and here I am in Belfast, where, you know, yeah, uh, we're both you, out of our countries. Yeah, Come over for this. Before? This is my first time. Yeah, I've but I've got it. a lot easier task on Saturday night yeah, than you do. Of course. <laughs> so coming in his backyard, I mean, you see Carl got out of the ring and everybody just went away. Obviously, this crowd is going to be heavily Frampton. How do you make sure that you stay focused in the ring and at the task at hand? Well, we're just gonna have to wait and see, aren't we? You know, I make adjustments on. You know, I've made adjustments on a daily basis to get where I'm at today, and and I'll make adjustments on the night. We've had a great training camp, and uh, we're gonna listen listen to my coach round by round, and we'll we'll, we'll get the job done. There's been a lot of uh, opportunity for you to see Frampton at his best, uh, even get beat by Leo Santa Cruz. Do you watch tape? Is there anything that you see in his game that you feel like you can expose? Well, I think. He, that was his best performance against Leo Santa Cruz, the first one. I think he hasn't had a, a, a performance like that since then. Maybe maybe he's on the slide. I don't know. Ooh. I'm going to have to be at my best to beat him and, and do something special. I realise that, but that's how world records are broken. They don't happen in the gym. They, they happen under the lights, and I feel it's my destiny to become world champion on Saturday night. In boxing, if no place else, being in somebody's backyard is a great disadvantage oftentimes on the scorecards. Are you concerned that you might need a knockout Saturday night just to come out of there with a victory? I think I think this is going to be fair. I think the judges are going to be fair. and I think if I listen to my coach and box the right fight, I'm not worried about the judges. I can't control that. So if the knockout comes, it comes. If, the, if I've got to go the distance, I'll go the distance. But I can't control stuff that I can't. You know, I can't worry about that. So I'll just, I'll just focus on what I'm going to do round by round and, and win every round. At this point, even with Jeff Horn, no, Australia doesn't really have like a, a premier fighter, a guy that really is the face of Australian boxing. With a win, you'd be a, it'd be a be huge the, upset in the globe. I'd be the number one then, wouldn't I? Huh? <laughs> I'd be the number one in Australia then, wouldn't I, if I beat him? And, yeah. and I'd be close to being the number one featherweight in the world also. So, um, look, Kyle's a great fighter. I, re I, I respect him, but I feel it's my time. Radio Raheem here with Action Jackson. Luke Jackson looking for his time Saturday night against Carl Frampton here in Belfast. A huge task ahead of you. Good luck on Thank Saturday so night, much, mate. Brother. It's Thank a pleasure you. to talk Thank to you and meet so you much. for the first time. Thank Radio Raheem with Luke Action Jackson.